how do you take that energy and, 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 and change it or adapt it when you have to work with these big actors who all have different ways of receiving stuff? Yes. Well, A, you're hitting the nail on the head because what people don't realize, the interesting thing about directing is that you have to change your language for every actor. I directed Steve Martin in a very different way than I directed Tina Fey. And you had to do it under the, with, with that sort of umbrella of it's the Pink Panther. So you've done Cheap Brothers, yeah. but the Pink Panther. That, and that was a whole other layer of complexity because you know you're doing a different Clouseau and all of that. But um, you do change your language. You change your approach. Sometimes, you know, some, something I did on this movie, sometimes with Hugh and with Dakota, the young boy, is sometimes I wouldn't even give direction with words. I would just pick a track on my iPod and I would play a song through a loudspeaker. Yeah. And I would say, guys, I'm not going to tell you what to do. Just listen to this song and go with the vibe of that. Dude. Show me what that means. Oh, dude, you better have good taste in music to pull I'm that off. I'm telling you, right? Yeah. And, uh, and I spend, like, I often spend three, four months before I shoot a movie just making playlists for every scene. Interesting. Um, and it's just a matter of, like, you, the job of the director is you do what you got to do by any means necessary to get your actor where they need to go. Wow. And so, whatever it takes. What did you do with Hugh? What was your, for Hugh Jackman, what was the, the playlist for him? Uh, well, Hugh, Hugh oftentimes, if there's a the climactic scene where Hugh is just kind of like he's shadow boxing on the outer edge of the ring. Yeah. And I went just with some old school Bill Conti Rocky theme. Nice. Because you know what? It's, it's like, like, what, what, 25 years later? You still can't beat it. No, as far as like rousing, up out of your seat, mojo, I think that Rocky theme is still unique. Who's harder to direct to get them to be somebody other than themselves? Steve Martin or Ricky Gervais? Ah, uh, that's a tough one because one of them, I mean, they're both really funny and I do want to work with both again, so I'm being very careful. But um, I don't know, man. Ricky, there is, there's nobody, not nobody who is audacious yeah. like Ricky. And what everyone saw in those Golden Globes, I would see every day on the Saturday Night Museum. And I'm just like, are we at any point going to do the script? Because that would be nice. And we never did. We never did the script, but he always brought funny stuff.